Hey YouTube, I was in my local supermarket today, um, well not local one, um, but anyway, I was in there and uh, I was looking for something something to cook up, you know, something to do, a little review, and i come across these, Chicago Town, I mean everyone knows Chicago Town, sort of ones I've done before, which are the, the pizza ones, and uh, yeah, I happened to come, come across these, subs. Um, first one here, as you can see, is Meat Feast. And I got all excited about that one. I thought, oh, wow. Meat Feast, subs, amazing. But then, as I read on, um, it basically topped with cheese, pepperoni, ham, all good. Then, yeah, mushrooms, red onions. Um, mm, not not big fan. Uh, yeah, so... Anyway, you know, the mushrooms is the main thing I don't like on that, but still, I thought, give it a go, see what it's like. Uh, you know, I thought maybe meatballs on there would be good. You know, when I think of meat feast, it's just meat. You know, don't mess about and don't put all the other stuff on it. Just, you just got to put meat on it. Um, when, I get, when I get pizzas before, you know, it's just it's got pepperoni, meatballs, ham, whatever on it. You know, it's just meat. And cheese. Uh, so the other one is uh, cheese and tomato. So not much to say about that. It's basically yeah, just uh, cheese and tomato. But I thought I'd get that as well. Try that one. These are the only two they had. Uh, I think they're one pound fifty each. You get two two in each one. Um, so I thought yeah, grab them. See what they're like. I mean, I'm not expecting much. I never really like these type of um, baguette type style pizzas. I'm not, not a big fan of them, but, you know, I thought I'd try it. So, uh, let's have a look. And the first one we're going to look at here, this is the, I uh, don't know if you can tell, that one there is the uh, cheese one, cheese and tomato. It looks alright. It's come out well. Actually, it did get a bit squished when it came out of the oven. Um, it said cook it for... I think it was like 13 to 16 minutes, but never ever cook it for what they say. Always just do it 10 minutes. It is from frozen, but it was been out at the out the uh, freezer for a while, so I thought, yeah, 10 minutes is about fair on that. So um, I'm trying to get a close up of that. I mean, that looks like it's got pepperoni in it, but it hasn't. That's no, just tomato there and cheese. Guess that's a bit of herb or something. It's either that or it's mouldy bit worrying uh, and then on to the next one and this is the meat feast one lacking meat I think <laughs> uh, and uh, okay you can see got the ham there got bits of pepperoni so it's like sliced up pepperonis you know not not big bits and you've got the mushrooms so um, what I'm gonna do give this a bit of a slice and uh, Try both. I think I'll start with the um, to that one, cheese and tomato one, um, and then try a bit of that one. So I'm going to put you down by uh, Tammy and Fantastic Four, as so called. We'll give this a little bit of a chop up. The old weapon. And give another one, a bit of chop up as well. Okay, so first, cheese and tomato. The cheese and tomato tastes great. I really like the sauce on that. Um, yeah, that tastes really nice. If you like your cheese and tomato pizza, um, yeah, that, that's good. I won't let you down. Now I'm going to go for the meat feast one. Um, let's see what that's like with the uh, dodgy mushrooms that I hate.
Mm. Right, with that one, I'm not really uh, getting much meat from that. Um, not really getting much at all. I mean, that, basically, on each one, I cut off the first quarter, the first, the first bit, and um, yeah, I don't know whether basically the meat's more down that end, but you know, I thought they would have had some. So what I'm going to do? I'm, I'm going to take a bite out of that bit with the dodgy, dodgy mushroom there. But I am going to take a bite just to see if I can taste any of this meat because it's just not tasting it. It's not great. Kind of getting it a bit, but you know, if you're going there for the the, the the meat feast, you know the you know when you get pizza, meat feast pizza, you're tasting a lot of meat. On that, I'm not tasting much at all. I'm not really tasting much of anything. At least with the um, the, the tomato, the cheese and tomato one, you know what you're going for. You you you're getting that. I mean, it's not easy to mess up, and uh, that is really nice, and the sauce is really nice on that. Whereas that one. I don't know, I kind of feel like, you know, if I just bought that and, uh, yeah, the meat feast, definitely, no, or I definitely wouldn't buy that again, not at all. Um, it's pretty bad, really. I mean, yeah, it should have chucked meatballs on there or something like that. Or even had the pep um, pepperonis, you know, not sliced up like they've, they've done it on this. Should have been proper pepperonis on it. Um, then it might have been a winner, but... Yeah, I won't be buying that again. Uh, it's quite disappointing, really. Um, yeah, well, that's it, you know. I'll eat both of these, probably enjoy them, you know, just wolf it down and do the job, but not not really happy. Well, you know, not not a great one anyway, Chicago town. Uh, I think you need to sort out the meat feast, definitely. That one, not too bad. I think that's all right, but that one... No, uh, you need to step up your game and sort it out. Maybe get rid of the mushrooms and put some meatballs on there or something, you know? <laughs> anyway, take it easy, YouTube.